First of all, starting with the beautiful name of Allah who is the most merciful and compassionate. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in and Spoken English Corner. So today I am back with another lesson which is about Ken. First I will explain that what does it mean by Ken and after that I will share some usage of it. So before moving towards the topic, if you people are new here on and watching my video at first time, so go and click on the subscribe button and don't forget to click on bell icon whenever I upload any new information regarding spoken English so you people will receive a notification there and I hope you will get a lot of benefits from it. So I think we should move towards the topic. Let's start. First, the topic is about Ken as I already mentioned at the beginning. Ken is one of the most commonly used model verb in English. So I think you would find difficulty about model verb that what does it mean by model verb you would worry about it. So don't worry you don't need to be worried about it. I'm gonna explain it that what does it mean by model verb. Model words are those words which are usually used with another word to express permission, ability, possibility and suggestion etc. So now here I am going to word some examples or some statements. Here I have taken two statements. Number one is be able to and the another one is be permitted to and after that I made some I made one one example on it. Number first one is they can rain fast. It means that it shows the possibility of present ability. Like if you put a glance on this example that they can rain fast. So it shows the ability of them. I'm talking about present ability. So be able to this statement comprise the sign of ability. Now the second one is be permitted to. Here from this word it shows suggestion or hint that and I have made another example on it that you can use the phone if you want to. So this example also comprise the sign of permission like you can use the phone if you want to. So that was just two examples through which I will clear your idea that how you will make the example on Ken and here I also want to clear one more point of you that is in this definition I mentioned that when you used model word with another word so it will express ability possibility suggestion so here if you put a glance on Ken so it is a model word and Ren is another word so it shows the present ability here I mentioned in the definition and the another one is like can is a modal verb and use which is another verb so this example also shows permission like I mentioned in the definition so after these things I'm going to explain some other situations of can like where you will be able to use can in those type of situations once you, once you use this uh, can in those situations so it will make your sound more natural and professional if you would stay tuned with me till the end of this video because this video is gonna be more interesting and beneficial for you guys. Thank you so much guys in case if you are being here with me so without wasting of your precious time so let's rock towards another situation where we will use can so can is used for ability permission request anger offer and general truth so first i have taken start from ability with the help of can you will show your ability like i have made few example on it look they can rain fast and the another one is that is I can do my math assignment and both of the example it shows the present ability of a person. The another one that I have for today that I have for about can that is permission or with the help of can you will be able to take a permission from someone like look how can we take a permission from someone with the help of can like 
can I leave now because there is an emergency at home? The situation would be like this that a person is working at office and directly he received a call from his home and he would inform about that there is an emergency at home and he is need to leave the office. So that is a statement with the help of this statement he will take a permission from his boss like can I leave now because there is an emergency at home and in, in return that how the boss will come across like the boss his boss will come across like you can go on off so that's all about permission which I explained so now the another one that I have there is request so with the help of can how you can make a request so now this example will clear your idea that how you will make a request with the help of can so can you help me out in physics numerical please a person is feeling some sort of complications while resolving a physics numerical so the another one that is anger anger so now with the help of can how you can show your curiosity so like look can you just shut up the situation is like that that there are some people who is teasing a person with the help of their matter and in return a person will come across like can you just shut up so now what does it mean by this statement so with the help of can you are able to make somebody quiet can you just shut up so the another one that is offer so with the help of can you are also offer anything to a person like can I help you to reduce your complications the another one is for the last one for today lesson is that is general truth like look the situation is like this that a 31 or a 30 person will come to you and he, he or she want to take some suggestion for you that I have much pity now please could you suggest me something that how will I lose my weight so there is a suggestion you need to come across like this statement like I'm just I'm just telling to you that maybe your suggestion would be like this it isn't compulsory at the beginning I said that it's need you need to be I'm so sorry for that it's not compulsory but I'm just telling you I'm just clearing your idea that how you how you would make the example on it like by taking exercise daily you can lose your weight so that's all about for today and that's all about Ken and if you found this video is beneficial for you guys so go and give me a thumbs up your thumbs up will motivate me and make me able to bring more amazing and interesting information regarding spoken English so see you next time see you with another important lesson which will be about another moral work like from today I have been started a series of videos on moral work so please don't miss them and don't forget to watch my upcoming videos maybe it would contain some interesting and important information for you guys so take care of yourself a lot because your life is much much more important for others. Goodbye and wish you best of luck.